This is an example of a unit of work on confident marks. In this unit, he is looking at tram stations and the train stations in Manchester and using very bold, confident marks and loose sort of brush strokes and pencil and drawing lines and pastel lines and charcoal lines to create an image. So straight off the bat, we see uh, these this pillar, this platform, and these kind of suggestions of figures and perhaps a train moving in the background. He said he's used long exposure photography to inform uh, his work. So there's some photography skills as well as drawing skills he's trying to put forward to the examiner. So we've got some photographs he's just taken uh, of train station. We've got quite a good drawing. Got a bit of detail in here. It's quite a complex thing to do a really detailed piece of work from. More examples of his night photography and uh, he's moved into pastel. More examples of photographs and this is where we see his first uh, attempt at an etching. We have another image here and another attempt at an etching. Obviously the dark images are uh, important and he hasn't rubbed much of the ink off the plate before he's printed them. So now we go into this slightly longer panoramic image which has got a combination of figures moving, uh, pillars, signs, etc. A bit of colour being introduced, more pictures, long exposure with the train is rushing by. There could be more commentary on these pages, I feel. Now he's starting to focus on areas, focus on sort of the three elements he's interested in, a moving train, figures, and maybe a pillar. This is interesting. When you look at this, you think, what is it? But it gives an idea of movement, and I don't know whether it's a light in the station or a view outside, but this is a sense of a tree. Train platform and a drawing. Then he starts, to, so now he's starting to look at these images by a Mancunian artist who is uh, Liam Spencer, does lots of views of Manchester at night, doesn't do train stations, really, does bus stops. Uh, and then, uh, again, somebody does a lot of figurative work at night uh, and in sort of the end of the day when the sun is set in or the winter light is quite bright, which is Bill Jacqueline. Many of these are sort of in New York, this one's in Italy. And you can see some nice sort of examples of a copy where he's trying to work out how he's going to introduce crowds successfully into his station paintings. And now we see a more advanced etching. And then we see a, a plan for him moving on to potentially final compositions. Oil painting. Very loose kind of idea. Again, there could be some annotations when you see the final images. This is something he's experimented with the background colour before he paints on top. Composition. Just selecting this area. Another composition. More ideas. More ideas. Not necessarily meant to show high level of drawing skills, but supposed to show a high uh, level of composition. And this is his composition for his final piece. One thing I would say about this project is what lets it down is a lack of commentary throughout the book. There are some incredibly strong images. There is some great pieces of artwork. There's some very relevant uh, links to artists, but he doesn't actually say much. And although it's all there, a much more convincing narrative would provide him with access to those higher marks. And finally, if we look at 
his final exhibition, what he produced outside the sketchbook, we see a number of, again, very strong images, good etching, but coming back to this idea, he needs a, a stronger narrative and more written content in his work.